They live in a wet and rainy land, a land of rivers and canals, in the delta of two of the world's great rivers, the Ganges and the Brahmaputra. The rivers and canals are alive with traffic. They are important highways in East Pakistan. Along the canals, boats serve as homes to many families. By boat, they go to places of worship. By boat, they carry goods to market. In the water, they raise their crops. Rice is their principal food. When rivers overflow in summer, young shoots of rice are planted by hand. And at harvest time, oxen and people thresh the rice with their feet. The machine age has not yet come to the farmers of East Pakistan. Out of the water, the people of East Pakistan get their most important cash crop, jute. These tall plants are jute plants. Burlap and gunny sacks are made of jute. Harvesting is done by divers as we see it here. It is very hard and slow work indeed. The jute is planted in fields before the summer floods. It grows faster than the water rises. At harvest time, it stands several feet above the water. The valuable jute fiber is found inside the bark. One by one, the stalks are cut open, the bark peeled off, and the fiber taken out. Men wash the fibers in the stream and hang them out to dry. Much of the East Pakistani economy depends on the jute fiber. It is this kind of trade that helps support Dhaka, the largest city and capital of East Pakistan. A thousand miles west from rain.